So Brendan, you came in here to, for what reason? Quit smoking. Quit smoking. And you've been smoking how long? 1983, so, or was that 20? few years, well, anyways. 20-some <laughs> 20 20 years, right? 27, 28 years. Right? Okay. So you're pretty good at it. Weren't you a pack? Oh, I was real good at it, yeah. Pack or pack two? Pack and three quarters, up to, so at, at points, yeah. depending on how busy I was at work or how stressed. So pack and three quarters, I had anywhere between a pack and a half, pack and three quarters. Okay. A day. So what have you experienced? You know, you came in here to stop smoking, and what did you? What have you noticed? Well, I noticed that I was able to do it. Uh, something that I thought couldn't do, right? I did, and it's funny because I didn't believe it, it was going to work because I had tried like the Chantix, I had tried uh, the patch years ago, and I cold turkey a couple of times, and I never never had success. So, laying down and going to sleep for like 20 minutes or so, I didn't think that was going to work either, but it did. Right. It did. And uh, the most amazing thing was, I mean, I, I, I knew at points before when I tried, I was a miserable person to be around. Uh, and this, this time I wasn't. I mean, uh, after the first session, I walked out of here not smoking, and it didn't smoke, didn't crave it. It would be kind of like there, but it would be something on the corner of my eye, like a, a thought that is gone. And I, I didn't, the key thing was I wasn't miserable and I didn't have the withdrawal, mm -hmm. the craziness, the, the, the shakes, the yelling, the screaming, the moodiness that comes with like, all right, this is, this is a craving that's gone. I, 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 uh, and I didn't have a hard time with it. I thought I was going to, but right. I didn't. Well, it's a good thing not to have that. Oh, absolutely, yeah. And that's one of the suggestions that we build into it so that we can minimize that. Oh, I'd like absolutely. to say everybody would be that way, but you know, that's a, you accepted my suggestion that we wipe it away. Mm -hmm. you know? Absolutely. And, uh, you know, I've I, well, been to the doc, I, well, doctor's appointment, I'm around a regular checkup. When he asked me, he asked me, he goes, oh, you cut down on your, you sound like you cut down on your cigarettes when I was doing my, you know, when he was checking my, because he always asked, because my mother had a double lung transplant. Right. And that's the reason why I, I, I don't want to smoke anymore. I don't want to be like that. I want to get, I don't want to get to there and hers was from smoking and eczema. And my doctor had always asked about that. He said, oh, well, it looks like you're cutting down. I said, well, actually, I quit. I just have a cold right now. So he goes, well, you sound like you have a cold and not a smoker anymore. So it's it almost three months, um, two and a half months now. Right. So. And I don't think about it. That's the amazing thing. I don't think about it. I, I see a pack of cigarettes like sitting right over there. Mm -hmm. It doesn't bother me. Right. I, it's not like I want to go over and smoke them. Or, right. Know, it's just not there. I don't know. It's amazing, I have to say. Good. So you happy you came? Uh, absolutely. Worth every penny. Absolutely. Great. Thank you.